in this video we are going to discuss about encapsulation in python programming first let us see the definition of encapsulation encapsulation means the wrapping up of wrapping of variables and functions under a single unit called class under a single unit called class so what is encapsulation the wrapping up of variables and functions under a single unit called class wrapping means combining combining variables and functions is called as encapsulation if you place variables and functions in a class then it is called as encapsulation the major advantage of encapsulation is data hiding we can achieve data hiding with the help of the encapsulation so data hiding means we can uh, uh, use the variables and functions of a class only inside that class only we can't use variables and functions from outside the class okay uh, for that we use as uh, private so we use as private access specifier in order to implement the data hiding now let us see an example program let we have a class called ncap ncap is the name of the class let here we have a variable called a whose value is 10 whose value is 10 okay next let us define a function so def def let name of the function is display display we must to pass selfie as the parameter let us display a value now so print off here a is some instance variable so we must use self in order to access that variable so print of self dot a now let us create an object for the class so e is equal to n cap now with the help of the object use display method as well as uh, we can access that variable also so print of print of e dot a here name of the class is n cap a is uh, 10 okay here uh, you know here there is uh, uh, generally in order to specify private variables we use as uh, uh, double underscore symbol here there is no double underscore symbol if there is no symbol then by default the variable will become the public variable here also there is no symbol before the display method so this method is also public method so here this is public variable and this is public function we can access public variable and public function from anywhere in the program so we can access these two within the class as well as from anywhere in the program we can access a and display because they are public members okay so print of self dot a here an object is created for the class e dot display so whenever the statement is executed control goes to the display method print of self dot a so what is a value 10 so 10 will be printed and after that print of e dot a here a is the here this a is the public member we can access this member from anywhere in the program so print of e dot a so what is a value 10 so 10 will be printed twice now in order to provide the data hiding we have to use as private access specifier but python doesn't support private access specifier if we want to make a variable or a function as a private then we must use two underscore symbols so let us use two underscore symbols before the a so underscore underscore a is equal to 10 now this a will become the private variable we know that we can access the private variable only inside the class from outside the class it is not possible to access the private variable so now we can write the statement as print of self dot before a we have to use two underscore symbol so self dot underscore underscore a okay so there is no problem why because uh, this display is nothing but this function only this class function only so this function can access the private data okay 
the private variables are accessible by public function of the same class public function of the same class here this display is nothing but public function so there is no problem e dot display we can access the display function why because display is nothing but public function only but the statement is wrong why because here a is a is defined as what private variable we can access private variable only inside the inside this class so we can't access this a from outside the program so if we write this statement then the compiler will give error message okay then python interpreter will give error message so e dot display method control goes to the display function print of self dot underscore underscore a so what is a value 10 so we will get 10 as the output if we want if we want we can maintain we can make this display as private also so how to make this display as private function by placing two underscore symbols before the display function okay now can we call this method like this e dot underscore underscore display we can't call display function from outside the program now outside the class now why because display is uh, defined as private function we know that we can access private function only within the class we can't access private function from outside the class so if we try to call display method like this then the python interpreter will use error message so in order to overcome that problem we have to define one more function let this function is public function let this function is public function this is public function why because there is no symbol before the show method now from this public function call the private function so we can call like this self dot underscore underscore display underscore underscore display we can call private member function from the public member function of the same class so there is no problem okay now from outside the class let us have the object e is equal to n cap now which function we have to call now we have to call the public member function here show is nothing but public function so let us call the show function e dot show so e dot show so whenever the statement is executed control goes to the show function from the show function we called private display function this display function so whenever the statement is executed control goes to the display function so print of self dot a so 10 is printed okay here in order to access this uh, private member variables we can use setter and getter methods we can use setter methods and getter methods in order to perform operations on private variables setter methods are useful in order to set the value in order to initialize the value whereas getter methods are useful in order to get the value in order to return the value now let us define one setter function and what getter function uh, let us define those functions as public functions so that we can call them from outside the program okay so let this is setter function so def let name of the function is set a so set a uh, we must pass self as the parameter let the second parameter is b so what is the use of setter functions by using setter function we can set the value we can initialize the value we can change the value so here uh, this a is nothing but instance variable so we must use self self so self dot this is private variable so underscore underscore a is equal to uh, let us change the value by performing some addition self dot underscore underscore a plus but this b is nothing but local variable of the set a function whereas underscore underscore a is nothing but instance variable we can access the local variable directly directly by using the variable name we can access the local variable there is no need of self b is the local variable of the set a function so directly we can use only b there is no need of self okay now let us have the getter method getter methods are useful in order to return the value so let name of the function is get a so we must pass self as the parameter getter method doesn't contain any parameter except the self okay so from this method let us return the value so return let us return the value self dot underscore underscore a underscore underscore a now let us call setter method as well as getter method so e dot set a of let us pass 30 
Next, get, for getter method, it returns the value. So we need to print that value. So print of e dot get gay. Okay. Here an object is created. Here set a and get a. Both are defined as public functions. So we can call them from outside the program. There is no problem. E dot set a of 30. So whenever the statement is executed, control goes to the set a function. What is the value 30? So 30 will be passed to b. So self dot underscore underscore a is equal to self dot underscore underscore a. What is the value of a? 10. So 10 plus what is the value of b? So 10 plus 30 means 40. Now this underscore underscore a, this private variable contain a value called 40. Next to print of e dot get a. Whenever this statement is executed, control goes to the get a function. Return self dot underscore underscore a. What is the value of underscore underscore a? 40. So that 40 will be written and it will be printed here. So likewise we can perform operations on the uh, private variable by using the setter and the getter method. So this is about encapsulation in Python programming. Now let us execute all these programs practically. Now let us see the practical implementation. Let we have a class called uh, encapsulation. Let name of the class is ncap. ncap. Uh, let we have a variable called a whose value is 10. There is no symbol before a. So this is public variable. Likewise, let us define the function def. Let name of the function is display function. Let us pass selfie as the parameter. We must pass selfie as the parameter. Here in order to, if you want to access a, a is instance variable. So we must use self. So now both a and a, this is called as encapsulation. Encapsulation means wrapping variable and functions under a single unit called class. Now this class encapsulation contains a and display. So that's why we are calling this as encapsulation. Now we need to create an object e is equal to ncap. Now let us call the display function e dot display. E dot display. Control S. Uh, let name of the program is uh, encapsulation. Encapsulation. Let us run the program F5. So we got output as 10. If you want, we can access that A from outside the program also, from outside the class also. Why? Because A is public variable. So print of A, E dot A. Now we will get 10 two times. So now that uh, 10 was printed uh, two times. Okay. Now let us make this variable as private variable. So how to make a variable as private? By keeping two underscore symbols before the A. Now... If we want to access that A, we must use two underscore symbols. Here display function is nothing but uh, function of this class only. So we can access private variable from the function of the class. There is no problem. Here this display is what public function only. So we can access them from outside the program. From outside the class. Yeah, fine. We got an error message. So why we are getting error message? Because of this statement print of e dot a but a is declared as private variable we can't access private variable from outside the class so let us place this statement in comment control s f5 so now we got 10 as the output 10 as the output let us uh, let us uh, define this function as a private function so we need to place two underscore symbols now let us call the display function now the program will produce us error basis why? Because now display function is defined as private function. We can't call the private function from outside the class. If we try to call the private function from outside the class, then Python interpreter will give error message. Now we got the error message. In this situation, what we can do is, let us define a public function. So def show self. Now let us call the display function from this self function. So self dot underscore underscore display. Self dot underscore underscore display. Here show is the public function. Now let us call the show function from outside the class. E dot show. Control S. Now there is no problem. So we got the output. We got the output as 10. Show is the public function. So whenever the statement is executed, control goes to the show function. From the show function, we call the 
display function so control goes to the display function and the value of a is displayed in order to access private member variables we can use setter method and getter method so def set a so self comma b setter methods are useful in order to set the value in order to change the value so self dot underscore underscore a is equal to this time performing some addition operation self dot underscore underscore a plus here this b is nothing but at uh, this b is nothing but local variable of the set a function we can access the local variable directly there is no need of the self in order to access instance variable only we must need self so we can access directly likewise define the get function getter method so def get a getter method doesn't accept any parameter other than self so for get by using getter method we can return the value so return let us return self dot a value self dot underscore underscore a now let us call getter method and setter method so e dot set a setter method means we must pass one value uh, let us pass 30 getter method means let us display the result so print off print off call the method in the print so e dot get a get a so 30 will be passed to the b so now self dot underscore a is equal to self dot underscore a means 10 so 10 plus 30 means 40 now we got output as 40 now we will get output as 40 yes we got output as 40 so, so this is about uh, encapsulation in uh, python programming